Hello everybody, this is a replay of V versus Green Tea on Akalon Waste, and this is, oh, come on, there we go. And this is a test, uh, showing a new replay layout, I actually watched an, uh, another tutorial, I guess Shift O, Shift L. So, I'm times two this bad boy, I'm going to watch it. So I'm going to kind of explain my build on uh, my screen. I'm going to shift Z. So it's going to be pylon on 9. Then the probe's going to go out and do a little bit of harassment here. Come up here and look for any... and look for the spine pool and gas tanks. Two things you're looking for is you know, those are going to be it. So as that's happening, uh, gateway as soon as you can afford it once the so there's the spawning pool, and then the gateway. So as you can see, this is on the uh, I think the stream one. So if I control in, yeah. So it's gonna be green team, me. There's a production tab. No one cares. And if you do, um, I'm actually going over my build pretty, pretty well. So it's gonna be three zealots one at a time slowly popping them out since um, I actually had enough money to build it but I was like oh you know what I'm gonna go for the harass first and uh, go from there so as we can see that the income is we're at 18 of uh, actually we're ahead or actually now we're equal I got more and now I gotta set up my three zealots so so shift O turns this on and off and then shift L turns that on and off. So that's cool. So shift actually does a lot more than what it's used to. So I'm going to ignore this hatchery, even though I know it's being built. There's the queen, bunch of lings. So I, and I'm using the mouse wheel, I can't do anything with it until I hit zoom in again or C. But. Oops. But. Uh, Z does. Uh, I like showing it like this because then you have a better understanding of what I'm, of my layout. So, and then I have my in-game ones for it. So units lost. There we go. So I got one queen, seven zerglings against uh, three. So and the resources are lost. Yeah, I've lost more because I lost the pylon. But he's lost uh, something more important. He lost the queen. There we go. So now this is more of uh, relentless aggression on my part, where I streamline units consistently while I keep building out of this, keep getting uh, more of my tech done. Should have plus one going. So there it is. So here. So now I'm hitting him in another time. So he's gonna lose a lot of the zerglings, and he's gonna might lose that thing. I don't think he ever lost that. Nope, he loses that game. So, uh, I'll list in the comments, or not the comments, the description. Shift L, Shift L for those, and how to get into the new UI uh, for these. Kind of hard to, it was not really explained well, so. And I'll explain it in the video, but I'll just sh show it down in the. Description, which is you go to the goes to I'll do it real quick while I'm waiting options oh it's actually pause the game gonna go down to gameplay user interface I'm on streamlined this is everything I have all my things set to so if you want to know it there you go um, always have my units on damaged so that way I know what's going what units are injured more than the others make sure that I, these are unclickable so that way when I'm playing I don't click any of these things on the bottom by accident. So, and that's how you do it. I'm here in the shadow. So I'm using Streamlined. So this is gonna be another um, aggression part. Upgrade if complete. we pause it real quick, take a look at the units lost. It does show 29 Zerglings and two Queens. And then we hit play. No, I don't. 
actually watch this kind of climb. So the stalkers got up before any other units, which is a bad thing. They need to be behind the zealots. And by that, um, should have noticed he took a third, but there's another queen now. So there's another 150 mineral that he's got to uh, work on getting. I will lose the stalkers. But he loses a chunk Lord of Wing. So it's, oh, there's another chunk. Can we look at this? The shift you do anything? No. Okay. <laughs> so in the units tab, he has eight larva. And now he's gonna produce more drone or more wings. And that's gonna really hurt his economy because he's not been able to build up uh, drones. And since I've only seen Lings and I've clicked on them a couple of times, um, there's no upgrades, or at least to tell me that there's roaches, you can see an armor upgrade, but there's none on those, there wasn't any on the queen, so, even though, wow, he droned really hard to get right back up, so now he's droning pretty hard, but like I said, he is on three bases, the E tab, there you the E mark. So he is on three, he's taking this fourth. So, and if we look at his view, he has not seen anything that's gone in my base. And now I've got a couple more gateways, four more gateways going down. Uh, take that off until the fight begins. There we go. So, sorry if you got most of the signature. So, here we go with the move out again. This time it's going to be all Archon. It's going to be Archon Zalt and Zalt Archon Charge Lot. Um, they should not have split over this chasm. So, he's got. Wow, pretty bad engagement. So, shift L. And if we go before that engagement. Okay, for this engagement, and we slow it back down. And then you just watch all his stuff melt. That's actually really cool to look at. I'm saying he has no upgrades on him, right? No, I got 1 1. But that's um, 1 2 or 2 1. <laughs> and then I go up to his natural. I don't really need to hit the third, there's no real reason to do it. So. Anyways. That's my game. Um, as this was going on, I was taking my nat uh, my third, putting cannons everywhere just because I know mutas were on the way. Even though I never saw the spire, I had a feeling because I didn't see roaches. And I know he uh, had a roach worn, canceled it halfway down, and then stopped building from it. So I was like, oh, well. And I was watching, I watched the replay earlier, so I was like, oh, okay. So I noticed. But this is pretty much the uh, Charge Out High Templar build. So, you pretty much just want to kind of go. You want to get this uh, as soon as you can. And you want to get Charge right after you. Right after you drop this, you want to get Charge. So, that's very important. You drop this, get Charge. You don't need to get um, Storm. Uh, not really big use for it in a PBZ. So, so 200, so, so anyways, uh, hope you all enjoyed, and, uh, did I miss anything? I don't think so. 
Uh, well, just make sure you get your upgrades going at the same time. Drop more gateways when you have money to do to do that. Um, still find oversaturated here, but this base right here covers that. So, uh, anyways, hope you all enjoyed. Have a good day. Wow. Bye.